Hi, Mia. Can you tell us a little bit about yourself? Well, I'm, I play sports, and I really like math. I'm pretty outgoing, and I just love hanging out with my friends. Uh, what kind of other activities are you in? I know you mentioned sports, but what specific sports do you play? I play soccer, and I run track. You did that all four years? Yes, I did. What uh, clubs have you been involved in? I've been involved in HOSA, and, which is like a sports medicine club, and I really enjoyed it. What kind of stuff do you guys do in that club? Well, we learn a lot about like the body and how to take care of injuries, and I got CPR certified from it, and then we go out on um, conferences and we learn more about them. So being an athlete, you think being in HOSA kind of gives you a little bit of an advantage as opposed to like a normal person that doesn't have that understanding of like their body and how it works? Yes, definitely. Like I chose to do that class and be involved in HOSA because I wanted to know more about my body. So like if I do get injured or if I feel like a tweak in something, I can know what it is and then address so, it. What are your plans for after the bridge? Well, my plans for after Healy Ridge is I'm going to continue my athletic and academic career at GCU. What are you planning to study there? I want to study mechanical engineering. Wow. So uh, you think some of your classes that you've taken here have kind of helped you prepare for that? Yes, definitely. I've taken pretty hard math, math courses such as AP Calculus. Wow. And I took an engineering class here my junior year, which also gave me an advantage. Since Mia entered her freshman year, she was full throttle on campus. She wanted really to do, be successful in her classes and she's shown that the last four years by enrolling in some of the hardest classes that we have to offer on campus. And she strived nothing for less than excellence in those classes. Um, talking with me over the past few years, I, I really didn't know the level of her athletic ability until about her sophomore year. And to find out that she's one of the best in the state at what she does in track really shows her humility. She, she shows that she's ready for the next level of college, um, not only academically, to, to compete athletically. Um, Mia is the kind of kid that is courteous, she's articulate, she's kind. Um, all of these things that you wish your kid grows up to be. So I'm proud to say that Mia corners in a healer chalk. So how do you find time to balance not only the sports, but your academics as well? Well, it's just a lot of time management, and actually being involved has helped me develop those skills. Like, I, being in AP um, Calculus, I'm able to manage my time because I know I have to get my work done. What, if you had to pick one memory from Gila Ridge, what is your best memory that you had? What do you think that would be? Definitely going to state the past three years in track. What events do you do? I long jump and triple jump, and I run the 100 and 200. Now, is there a lot of other people that do those events that are also in AP calculus and mechanical engineering or whatever the engineering class was? Like, I'm sure there's not a lot of athletes no. that are taking those higher level classes. So, how do you feel knowing that you kind of represent not only your team and your teammates and everybody, but you kind of represent the entire school of Hill Ridge? Um, it's very humbling, and it's it's nice to know that people look at me in that way because that was my goal. Like I wanted to leave my mark and I wanted to really show people what I'm made of and it's just what's a better way than being on a billboard. I think you've definitely done that. Now when you came to school as a freshman, I know four years kind of goes by really quick, but did you kind of see yourself having this kind of success or you know your first couple days were you really nervous and like timid and quiet? Like how have you grown as a person in these last four years? Coming into high school, I was pretty shy and not as outgoing. I knew I had an athletic ability and um, I was always pretty good in school and pretty focused, but I did want to go to college and I wanted to get my college paid for, so I worked hard and I met friends through like varsity soccer, varsity track, like I've met a lot of people and that just helped me develop as a person throughout my high school career. All right, Mia, well, thanks for telling us about yourself, and we wish you the best of luck next year at GC. Thank you very much.